Welcome guys, I figured I would show you how to install the Motorola QC diagnostic drivers that you need in case you want to uh, unlock your Motorola Droid Razor M or Motorola Droid Razor HD. This is the XT907 or XT926. Remember, uh, if you have the XT915 or any other Motorola Droid device, this will not work for you, unfortunately, but for the XT907 and the XT926, once you get the phone into um, a, uh, BP Tools mode by holding the volume up, volume down, and the power button until the menu with the white text comes up, and you scroll down with the volume down key to BP Tools mode, and then hit volume up so that the phone boots properly, wait till the phone boots, and then plug it into your computer. It will install, most likely install the networking driver and the actual driver for the phone itself, but it won't install the diagnostic driver, which is the one that you need. So, with the phone in, uh, with the phone on and in BP Tools mode, uh, you will uh, get prompted to uh, have the, ah, uh, goodness, to have the drivers installed. But the drivers won't install. So here's how you do it: you go into your uh, computer management and go to Device Manager. Now, the driver that you want to install is the QC interface. You're going to right-click this and click Update Driver Software. You're going to browse My Computer for driver software. Let me pick from a list of drivers. Scroll down here to ports, as soon as I can find it, there it is. Scroll to ports, click next. On the left side menu here, you're gonna click Motorola, and then from the right side here, you click QC Diag port. Click next, it'll prompt you telling you that the driver's not recommended because it may not be compatible because it's not a signed driver. Just click yes, and it will install the driver, and boom, Motorola QC Diag port. Now, uh, you may need to change your COM port um, if you have so many um, connected comms. If you, as you can see, I've got like 54. I think I've got like 60 some odd comms uh, on my computer because every time you install a new port, it adds a new COM. Um, if you want, if you need to lower the COM port for the cracked version of CDMA Workshop, right-click the QC Diac, go to Properties. Go to Port Settings, click Advanced, and then here you'll see the COM port number, and you just set it to anything lower, uh, whatever you want. Yeah, see all the comms that I have? That's how many phones I've connected to this thing. Um, and then you'll click OK, click OK, and go back to my Motorola Droid Razor M, Droid Razor HD unlocking video, and proceed with the unlock process. Hope this guy has cleared that up for you guys, and I'll catch you next.